Hey, how's it going? Today I'll show you how to get the app called Televisa to your Fire Stick or Android TV device. The whole process is pretty simple and will take you only a couple of minutes. And firstly, you will have to get the app called Downloader on your Fire Stick. If you already have Downloader on your device and it is properly set up, then you could actually skip this step. But if you don't have Downloader yet or you are unsure if it is set up correctly, then of course you gotta follow me. So firstly, you go to the search on the Fire Stick, open the search bar and start typing downloader in here. And as you can see, downloader has already popped out for us at the bottom. Just click on it and here's this app, which you need to get to your device. But then after you got downloader, it's not over yet because you still have to set it up. So now in order to actually set up downloader, we have to go to the settings. So let's do it. You click on that button with a gear icon, then scroll down and go to My Fire TV. Open it. And now in here, all you have to do is locate the developer options and turn them on. But on some Fire Sticks, and especially on the new Fire Stick devices, the developer options might be hidden by default. So if that is the case, and you cannot find developer options anywhere, then no need to worry because it's pretty easy to make them appear. Just have to go to about, select fire to be stick, and now you gotta start clicking on the middle button on your remote. And do it fast, so let's do it. And as you can see, now for me at the bottom it says no need, you are already a developer. That's in my case. And in your case it will say that you have become a developer now. So if you go back a bit, you will finally see developer options. Open them, make sure to turn on the ADB debugging, then you go to install unknown apps, and in here, all you gotta do is locate downloader and just turn that option on. So what it does, it's gonna allow you to install other applications from the internet and not necessarily only those apps, which are only available in your official Amazon App Store by default. And that's exactly what we'll do right now. So now we go back to the list of apps on a Fire Stick, open it up, and here is the downloader, which is set up and ready to use on your device. But before actually using the downloader, there is one more thing which I always recommend doing. And it's of course connecting to a VPN. In my case, I mostly use NordVPN. Because they're super fast, they got a great app for Fire Sticks, Android TVs, phones, laptops, or pretty much any other device you may use. And they are not expensive for such a premium service. In fact, they cost less than a cup of coffee per month, which is a great pricing for us, the users. All you gotta do in a VPN app is connect to any server. Let's say we connect to Germany right now, and from the moment you connect, all your traffic is gonna be totally encrypted. It means that no one can track you or snoop on you online. And that's really important if you wanna stay out of trouble. And if you don't have a VPN yet, but you want to try it out, then I do have a great offer for you. If you use my link, which will be in a pinned comment below this video or in the description of this video, you'll get three months of NordVPN totally for free, which is an amazing offer. And if you're watching this video on your TV or on your Fire Stick, then just grab your phone or your computer, open up a web browser and go to topvpnoffer.com. That's my website, which is going to give you the same amazing deal for NordVPN with three months for free. Or just scan the QR code which you can see on the screen right now with a camera of your phone. It works the same way and it's also going to give you the same deal for Nord. And now, finally, let's use Downloader safely. So we go back to the list of apps near Fire Stick, open it and let's head for the Downloader now. So open the Downloader, go to the search bar and in here now you have to start entering a code, which will be for seven, four, three, one, eight. So once again, four, seven, 
4318. That is the code you have to enter. Then you just click on go. And while it's loading, make sure to subscribe my channel. So you will get even more content about Firesticks. And now that the load of the app has started, usually it does not take long, but of course it all depends on your connection speed. Then click on install and wait a bit until the app is fully installed to your Firestick. Then do not click on open yet, instead press on done, because this way you get an option to delete the installation files as you don't really need them anymore on your Fire Stick. So just click on delete and then delete once again. And now if you go and take a look at the list of apps on your device, here at the bottom you will be able to find the Televisa app, which we just got for you. So now, first of all, I would recommend you to click on the options button on your remote. That's the button with three horizontal lines, right next to the home button on your remote. Just click on it and press on move to front. This way, the app will always be at the very top of your application list, and therefore it's gonna be way easier for you to access the app every time you need it. Just don't forget to keep the VPN connected to stay safe and out of trouble online. And once again, you can use the link below this video to get three months of NordVPN totally for free. And then you can finally go open the Televisa app on your Fire Stick, then click on Create Playlist, and after that, it depends on your IPTV provider, of course, but if your provider gave you an M3 link, in that case, you click on New M3 Playlist, click on it, then add any name to your playlist. After that, enter a link or attach it as a file. And after that, just save it all, and then the playlist will appear. To save it, you have to click on that check mark in the right corner of your screen. But alternatively, sometimes IP providers might give you XRM codes instead of M3 links, so it's an option as well. In that case, you click on New XRM Codes, add any name, and then enter a username, a password, and a link, which is given to you by your provider. So that's how you can set up and get Televiso app on your Fire Stick in 2025. Enjoy and see you next time. Bye-bye.